What up, people? In today's video, we're going to show you how to get pain. All right. So in order to get pain, you're going to want to do a leap village. And make sure that it's act six. It's the raid. Uh, you want to have maximum damage totem buff. And uh, basically two farm units that are really good. Also, you want to have uh, four strong units that you could use. Right now, I'm just testing to see if Atomic could solo. If I could solo with just Atomic, this is even with this bad placement here. Let's see. If he could solo for me, that's really nice. Because I'll just use his ability. Now, I have Avatar, and I don't know if the ability scales for him. So I'm going to test this out real quick. But, uh, yeah. You should have enough money to basically fund any unit placement. But you want to win this. Because for some reason, when you lose, this uh, it doesn't let you retry. I don't know. It's weird. But anyways, so... As I could see, we're taking care of the first boss easily. Now, second boss is pain. He's right over here. As you can see, we're using Tiny Task. And I'm just playing another game in the background. Don't worry about that one. But, uh, yeah. You're going to want to follow these orders. Uh, exactly what I'm doing. And if you don't have the characters that I'm using, basically, you could try uh, your own way of doing it. But as you can see, we weren't able to solo with just him. Well, actually, we were. Okay, that was easy. And we've done it more than three times. And we got pain and uh, we've gotten rerolls. So I don't know what you're missing when you do it more than three times. It's weird. Anyways, let's just start by recording. Boom. I'm going to click on retry. I'm going to click on this screen. I always click multiple times on retry because sometimes it bugs out. Now you want to wait five seconds. Click on the screen back. One, two, three, four, five. Using WASD, move back with S. See the tree? Move here. See the tree again? Move. Now when I see the mound, I'm going to go here. Pass over the bush. Miss the tree, I'm going to hit the wall. Boom. Hit the wall, good. And I hit that corner right there. I'm going to walk to this corner. Boom. And then I want to click here. Click. And place this unit. I'm going to click multiple times to make sure I place them. And beautiful. We just made money again. So I'm going to click here again. And I'm going to place this unit right here. All right. I'm going to click multiple times. Now I'm just going to chill. Just going to chill for a minute. Uh, yeah, if you want damage buff, basically you could buy it in the raid shop. Uh, that There's certain things that give you damage buff. I suggest if you can't do number six, do number five a bunch of times to stack up the damage things. We're going to be chilling though. Should be very easy to do this. this especially since we're going to use also the another character. We're not just going to use uh, Atomic, but he could solo Act 6, which is nice to know. All right, click again. The one thing that you could mess up is if you don't click in the right place. So always are sure that you click in the right place because that could mess up your whole task. That's what happened last time. I started this video and I ran it back and it didn't work. So this is the second time of me recording a video trying to see if it works. So obviously we're going to go through this once. And uh, I found out that at wave 13, we could start placing units. Because that's when the first units uh, approach our guy. That's when we start placing units down is wave 13. Yep. But before that, we're just trying to farm money. I clicked a little bit close to the side, so I always want to make sure I'm clicking in the right place. We're going to get enough money to 
maybe not level him up here. We're not going to get enough. We're going to have to level up the other dude. Watch. Yeah, we only have 10k. Level up this dude. Is it 12 or 13 that we start placing units? I'm going to be risky bisky. And then I'm going to click on this, click on this, and then just wait. Okay, we did good. And just in case, click on him again, upgrade, upgrade, and then we're going to click on him because we'll have enough money to upgrade him to the max. Click, click, click. Just in case I didn't upgrade him, I'm still going to try to upgrade him later. So I'm going to chill for a minute. I'm going to do the same thing. Click here. Click on this, wait till the next wave, and fake upgrade him. This is just a fail safe, just in case I didn't upgrade him for, I don't know, some reason. But it looks like we're good. All right, everybody should be chilling. We're going to wait for money, okay? And now we're going to fully upgrade this dude. Put him, like, here. Click in the place a bunch of times. Then I'm going to off click and then click on him again. Make sure you want to be precise with this. And just so I make sure this is the fail safe, I click off and then I click back on him. And then I upgrade. And then I click off and then I click on and then I upgrade. Because if we don't have him, we're kind of cooked. Everybody's good. Everyone's upgraded. Yeah. So now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to upgrade him to the max. And I'm going to drop this dude right here. Click a bunch of times there. Click off. Click on. Upgrade. Now this should be more than enough to basically solo. And now I'm just chilling on I am Atomic. And I don't click anything. In fact, I don't even like that placement. That kind of scares me if I'm going to misclick. In fact, you know what? I'm not even going to do it that way. I'm going to wait until I get pain in my view. Then I'm going to click on him, on the main character. The main character. Basically, though. We could use Saitama, too. We have enough to afford Saitama. But nah, this is simple to AFK. I was doing it in Act 5. That's why I know it's possible in Act 6. I was just wondering if... Uh, I was doing Act 5 at first because I wasn't sure if I was able to do it. But yeah. It's, uh, there's almost no difference in time. We could put, uh, Griffith a little bit further towards there to also attack and slow. But I don't care about that. The less clicks you do, the more successful your tiny task is going to be. And that's just the rule. Don't try to overcomplicate it, your tiny task, because, uh, you overcomplicate it, you're just causing problems for no reason. All right, so this is where we're going to have to cook. Boom, click on him. Put this here. Pain's going to pull up in render view. As soon as he disappears behind that pillar, I'm going to click. I'll actually, I'll give him a little bit of time to make his way. Also, at the end, we want to wait a couple seconds before ending it, just because of lag and stuff. I am atomic. All right. So then we count when we see the end screen. One, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's eight minute tiny task right there. And let's see it work. Hopefully everything works according to plan. Let's see. We spawn in. We wait five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. And now we can start moving. Beautiful. Hit the tree. See the tree? Don't touch it. Tree can mess up shit. Even the hill can mess up shit. Try to make sure you don't like you hold down properly. We're going to do a double tap here, right? Boom, boom. Yeah, we wipe it. And then we hit the corner. All right, it's looking good, people. Tiny tasking this. This is for rerolls, for pain, and for uh, ninja scrolls. But rerolls is a big thing in this. You do be getting fours and fives, and yo, that's big. Getting fives? Hello, give me that. I heard it was 30%. So if we run this 100 times, basically, that's only... Uh, we're making bank, basically, yo. That's a lot. We run it 100 times. That means 30, 30 times 5. You know, let's say 30 times. We get just normal RNG or a little bit below average RNG. And we get 30 times where we get the rerolls. Let's say we get really bad RNG and we get 4. That's 120 rerolls. And if it's 7 minutes, 7 minutes is kind of complicated. Okay, you know what we'll do? We'll do six minutes, right? A hundred times. That's uh, 600 minutes. That's 10 hours. So, yeah. Let's just say 12 hours. You run it for 12 hours. And, uh, yeah, you're getting 120 rerolls. 10 rerolls an hour? That's not that good. But sometimes it's shit, yo. I remember running it for, uh, what do you call it? I ran that shit for a day, and I swear I had like 17. So yeah, this is like a lot better. A lot more efficient if this works. You always got to run it back to see if it works, people. Just because it works the first time around doesn't mean it's going to work the second time around. Consistency. That's also why we don't place people near stuff we can't place them near. They're far away from the rocks. I tried to place Shadow further away from the road, as you could see. Uh, if you saw in the beginning when I placed first place Shadow, I placed them a little, or Sid, you call them whatever you want. I placed them a little further away from the road. That way, if we are off by a couple centimeters or whatever, we should still be good. Because it does change. It does fluctuate sometimes. Especially when walking. In, uh, during the tiny task. You know. Usually I don't advise you to walk. Since we are walking. You cannot do this on mobile. And you can't do this on Mac either. It's just not going to work. We're doing this on a good PC. Because we get good response. Okay we're cooking. I like this. 12? Okay, 13 is when we got to start placing. Yeah, 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 don't make no mistakes. Yeah, we get 28 right away. And we waited. Oh, no. Come on, click. Okay, yeah, that's good. That's good. That's good. He already has good range and everything. I, yeah. Five. He's already at doing 2.8 million. We're chilling for a while. Because right there is where you could lose. If our timing's a little off, if there's a little lag or anything. That's why if you're just like, if you're just making it, you're probably going to lose one time. And if you lose, you cannot retry, unfortunately. It just bugs out. I don't know why. But that's just the way the cookie crumbles. You saw what happened there? We upgraded him when we weren't usually upgrading. So, we should be good still. 
because I think I did a fail safe. Notice how, why I did fail safes now. Because sometimes it doesn't work out. Sometimes the timing's off, as I said. Click, click, click. Let's say that didn't work. I'm like, oh, snap. I'm missing money. Then look, we're still getting paid here. Boom. Then I upgrade again. See? And I'm like scared. Because I know if he fails, we fail. That's poetic. All right, we won, basically. Let's just see if we click retry again. And if we click retry again and everything works, then we're gonna go to the store and we're gonna buy some juice and let this run. Even though we have paint already, we're getting rerolls now. Better than uh, anything in the game right now. Maybe you do be getting, I don't know, I haven't tried Hell or Marine or anything for rerolls. Let me know if you're getting fives and fours or if it's only this one. I haven't tried the other raids. But uh, yeah, this should be easy enough to AFK this. All you got to do to get said to is just do the quest. There's a little quest. And yeah, simple to do. You got to do all the things. If you're looking for his beads, it's basically on the summer map. Inside, uh, there's a little, like, fortress. You got to climb up the stairs. There's, like, a little stairs. Climb up the stairs in the summer, on the summer map. And you get his beads there. It's really easy to spot. They're glowing red. Yeah. Now you can see we're going to do the I am atomic. We're going to wait, wait, wait. And then it should insta kill him. I would like to see an enemy counter. I don't mind that enemy counter on the map. Okay, he's waiting a little bit too much, but that's okay, because he's dead. And when they're dead, they're dead. Now we have to click retry. This is eight minutes and seven seconds. It goes a little longer than uh, what we did before. So it stopped at 8.11. I don't know why it does that tiny test, but it did that. And it looks like we're doing the same formula. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. And uh, if you have any questions, too bad. No. Ans I'll answer them in the comments. Don't worry. But uh, I think I pretty much answered everything. You know? You just have to watch the video and see what I do. If you have different characters uh, and you're not strong enough... I suggest you maybe only farm number five doing this strat. Same strat as number six as number five, you know? Just try it out and see what's up. Let me know if you're successful. And if you enjoyed the video, drop a like. Peace!